Hello. Hola. Grocery service. So, what we have today. We've been thinking about, I don't know if uh, anybody's ever Try. done this, tried this, but. Okay, so basically, we see, uh, we see the benefits of uh, SRT. You know, you can just shoot your line up in the tree with a big shot or air cannon or whatever. And you don't have to fish the little bean bag down on the same side or nothing like that. It just goes down and base ties it, you know. You base tie it and there you go. So, we thought we'd try something. Same kind of idea, but with double rope. So, we've already shot a line up in this pecan tree. It's not real high up there, but just for demonstration purposes. And we're kind of trying this out for the first time here. We're kind of curious to what y'all think there in the, you know, tree brotherhood. I don't know if this is, a, you know, I can't believe we're the th first to, to think of it. Yeah. I mean. So basically, this is a combination of SRT and double rope. It's like a, a comp, I don't know, your, your false crotch systems. You know, yeah, cambium saver, friction cambium saver, saver, whatever, but SRT style. Right. So it's weird. Yeah. Basically, what we got is this. <clears throat> got my splice die, carabiner, my pulley. This is going to be my false crotch. So what I'm gonna do is open it up. Put my double rope here in the pulley. Right? Right. So now, okay. this is essentially my false crotch. Right, but it's down here. Right. So, so now, okay, so. If you would please. Yes, I'm going to pull up this rope here. Now I got this rope going up in this pecan tree way up there. I'm going to try to hold the phone and do this at the same time. So I guess you're just going to hold the... You're going to hold it? Yeah. Okay. See, so you see what he's got here? So he's going to pull my rope. And I'm holding my zigzag. He's going to pull this all the way up to that top crotch there, if you, if you can see it. Keep going. Right about there. Alright, so now let me zoom in on this. So I'm all the way up there, and if you come down on the other side, like SRT, right, I'll have to go through all these limbs and stuff. Right. Don't have to come out. My side. rope, both leg, both legs of my rope are on one side of the tree. Right off the bat, no fishing it, trying to fish it over some limbs or, or, when I climb, I gotta go past these limbs and buck and. And uh, go around it. Are, so we now, high, are we high enough? Yeah, we're high enough. So basically, what I want to do is we're going to base tie it just like SRT. Well, what we're going to do is we're going to just do a girth hitch. Right. 
I get it up a little higher than I want. That's pretty good. Yeah, she, she's yeah. up there. A little bit higher than I want because it's going it's to come down just a bit. Okay. All right, sit into it there. So now, yeah, I'm going to sit into this. Yeah, I'll hold it from here. Okay, basically, there we go. Now, I know... <laughs> basically, I'm SRT on one side of the tree and double rope on the other. This is my false crotch. Right. And then, we'll, of course, to pull this out when we're done, we just re untie the base tie and oh, pull wow. both ends of the climbing line and done. Now, as far as changing your crotch while you're in the canopy, if you have to move your tie-in, you can just unclip the carabiner and pulley and unclip your base tie somewhat on the ground where you can be able to move it. Well, what you can do is you can use this to get where else you want to go, climb to your new tie-in, and then have some have the ground worker undo your base tie and then pull this over and redirect like you would yeah. just pull it just unclip redirect over another limb right. leave it in the same spot originally so now it's in two spots and then clip back into it voila right. and then you can undo that it's still in the original and you can just push down on your zigzag and they can pull your crotch way back up to where it was and base tie you again. Yeah. In theory, we are just trying this. Here we go. Let's see how it works. Is this safe? I don't know. It's, it, I think it is. It's all ANSI rated. It's ANSI standards. Is it smooth? Oh, it's so smooth. <laughs> it's really smooth. We're not filmmakers. <laughs> and by the way, it just stormed, so this is a soaking wet pecan tree. So smooth. Is it smooth? Is it smooth like Keith Stone? <laughs> oh, but you, we gotta see if you can get up the tree, actually get up there with it. Yeah. Oh, I know. And see, the other benefit I see is, like SRT, if, if that little crotch breaks out, he's just going to come down to the next one, where traditional double rope, even with a friction saver, you know, if your limb goes, if <laughs> the one you're tied in on goes, well, you're, you're coming down. But... To wear those bikes. Oh, yeah. no, not right now. <laughs> How did you get the rope up there that high? Uh oh, the magic trick. <laughs> magic trick. <laughs> uh, we have a tool for that. We uh, a slingshot type device. Big shot. Oh, I like this. Do you like this? I like this. I like this a lot. You think?
Then you can get around the tree good with that, or what? I mean, you know, another... Oh, yeah, dude. You trust it? I trust it. That's awesome. So, like, another thing, if you want to change crotches, you can just abandon this and just tie into a natural crotch, you know, just like normal, and throw this down. I mean, I guess. You okay? You all right, monkey man? Okay. Anyway. This system is awesome. Huh? This is awesome. <laughs> I like how easy it is now. Right? It's like no friction, dude. I mean, I... <laughs> Yeah, I know, the tree is slip. the tree is soaking wet, but it's thunderstorming here. Yeah, now if you just like went up there and then like rerouted your rope and came down underneath the other side of the tree. Yeah. That's so slick. There you go. Yeah, use them knees and stuff. <laughs> right? It's pretty smooth. It's smooth with the zigzag. So now you would never tie it in around that little limb, but the way it is now, you feel safe with it like that? I said the way, okay, you would never tie into the limb that you're on. No. But in this configuration. I would just come down to the next one. Right. It broke. You feel safe, right? Yeah. Yeah. Because even it. Anyway. English ain't my first language, I guess. See how smooth it is. The sea repel like one of those commercials. <laughs> yeah, it's super slick. <laughs> this uh is life support. Well we're thinking about calling it maybe D S R T Double Single Rope Technique. So now all I gotta do mm -hmm. to undo all of this. Right? Pull down a little bit. And snap. Base tie. Take the carabiner out. Uh huh. Right. <clears throat> now just pull down on your climbing line, both ends of your climbing line, till you get your pulley. No. Yeah. Till you get your pulley back. There you go. And check it out, friends. <laughs> Too cool. There's your false crotch. Done. Right there. 
Unclip that, pull it out. No retrieving ball. No cambium savers. No uh, rope guide. Yep. Nope. Just the stuff we already had from back when we had like you know hitch climber pulleys and whatever that could set up. Yeah. You know everybody's got extra. Well, should have extra pulleys and ropes, ropes and carabiners. If you're in this business, which makes me think somebody else has had to have done this. And if not, why not? I, I would think. It's simple, right? It's really simple. Yeah. I mean, yeah, it takes two climbing lines now. Or whatever, but... Most of us have two climbing lines, you know? I mean, like, you want a new pretty climbing line. Ooh, that's a prettier one. This, I like that one, so I'm going to buy it. eliminates... This eliminates retriever balls... Mm hmm Can be of savers, money for that stuff. Um, yeah, you don't have to fish you don't have to fish the your your throw ball on the same side, you know, you don't have to you don't have the obstruction when you get up to that point. None of that. You know what I mean? The the, the limb that you have to like buck in and then go have to unclip and go over. You don't have to, you don't have to do that. So, you know, I mean, look, we're, we're, we don't know much about SRT. But what we do know, we have applied. We're, yeah, we're like, well, how, how can we take, how can we, like, reap the same, <laughs> same benefits, you know? Now, we don't have the one, we don't have, like, the pull down 12 inches, go up 12 inches. We still got that, but we, but we have the mechanical advantage. And we don't need, like... I don't know. We just don't need all that special gear. Yeah. So if this is like a redneck way of doing it, okay. and nobody likes it, uh, whatever. Interested. We're interested in what you think. Let us know. If yeah. it's like, wow, holy crap, uh, why didn't we think of that? Well, that's great. Let us know that too, you know. I never thought of it until like last night. But, you know, big shot being, you know, like crouching a rigging line. Pull your climbing line up and done. Anyway, thank you. Y'all be safe. Have fun. Toodles. Jesus loves you. He does.